uh, presentation of academic awards is so important to the uh, University of Texas. We're recognizing the student athletes for their hard work and dedication in pursuing their education. And at a place like the University of Texas, that's of prime importance. Uh, we, we view the uh, preparation of our student athletes for life after competition as uh, very, very important. So tonight is a great night to have uh, coaches and athletes and our academic advisors and especially parents of many of the athletes here to participate in this award. It's a special night for us. You know, anytime you can get recognized for something that you do, you know, off the field, um, it's obviously a good feeling. Um, you know, there are a lot of great athletes out here, but a lot of even better students. So um, it's nice to have a night like this and get recognized for some uh, what we do in the classroom, not just on the field. I think academics is really important as an athlete, you know, it's half of our name, student athlete, and you know, I've really tried to work hard in the classroom over my four years, and I think it's paid off. I'm excited to, you know, go on stage and accept, you know, an award or two on my team's behalf. A huge part of our lives, um, you know, people take 12, 15, 18 hours sometimes a semester, um, many more hours in the library, and so to recognize this achievement um, for a lot of our student athletes, is this is just a great opportunity for us to do that. We have such a great support staff here. Um, our academic staff is probably the best in the country, I would say. Um, so it's really, it's really cool to just be able to see all of my hard work pay off in the classroom. We come here as athletes and, you know, before we get to college, it's all about our athletic ability and how good we are. And then once we get here, you know, it's a reason why we're called student athletes. You know, that student piece comes before um, that athlete piece. And, you know, we have had so much support over, I mean, my past four years of being able to, you know, expand and grow and become the, the person that I am today. And I wouldn't have been able to do that without the people that help with our academic program. The academic counselors really help us in uh, managing our time and our tutorings and such and, and we all just focus on football when it's time to focus on football and focus on school when it's time to focus on school. I'm really grateful for our academic center. I'm grateful that we have it. I'm grateful that I can look at my GPA and know that that is because of the academic center. As a rowing team, you know, we take student athlete very seriously. So we dedicate a lot of time to rowing and to school, sort of coming together to realize that those two things uh, really do come together and to be a successful team we need successful academics as much as we need to be successful on the water. It can be very difficult at some times but I think having both kind of keeps you balanced. You work hard on, on the track for me and then you know how to work hard in the classroom too. So just like you set goals in track and field, you set goals academically so I mean it can be difficult but it definitely helps each other. I'm coming out, graduating in May and having a job, so that's been awesome, but I couldn't have done it without everybody in the academic staff. From the tutors to the, the academic services with the counselors to just, you know, being able to stay in a really, really good environment to study late at night, it's been fantastic. Just knowing that I'm able to get my degree here from the University of Texas, it's a huge accomplishment in and itself. It just shows, shows that hard work carries you a long way off the court as well as on the court and um, I realize I'm a senior right now and everything that I've done at this school, um, I get to leave with something, uh, which is my degree. And uh, nobody can ever take that away from me and that means a lot to me and my family. Uh, and I mean my Longhorn family as well.